Thank you very much, Dave. Good morning, everybody. We've got a fantastic day of agility and all sorts of different things going on here in the main arena. We're going to start off with the novice and medium ABC. So please, first of all, we do need a judge. Put your hands together. For our judge today is Kathy Keith. So let me tell you a little bit about the ABC. What it stands for is anything but a collie. So you're going to see lots and lots of different breeds in, the, uh, in this competition, in the arena. And the reason we do that is that uh, collies tend to dominate the sport of agility. Um, and it does actually just showcase some of the other breeds that are absolutely brilliant at agility. So I think we're ready to go. Uh, this is Laura Lee with Murphy, the Cocker Spaniel. He's a 10-year-old. And this is his first time at Crufts. So the five uh, indicated by our judge. And another one there. There's a total of 10 forks at the moment as we go into those weeds. Just uh, picking up on another five there. So that's 50 forks at the moment. So down into the top. Turning right. Two to go. Well done. Okay, so that was a total of 15 forks for Laura and Murphy. So the time was 38.120 for that last dog with 15 forks. Okay, so next on the line we have Alan Dorman. This is Gunny, Golden Retriever. Parset Flax is his uh, full kennel name. So what, what uh, we're watching here as well is the large dogs. And obviously we have no contact equipment in the ring at the moment. So this tells us this is a jumping round. And the agility will be uh, in here later on today, so make sure you can watch that. So, turning right there, down into the tunnel. It's got to turn right now. Nicely done there. That's a wing wrap, we call that. Over the wall, over the final jump, well done. Clear round, 31, 2, 8, 4. Well done, Alan. Okay, so next on the line, this is Carlos Longuera Bar. This is Billy, the Kelpie. Morgan's Rocker Billy Rebel. He's a rescue dog. So turn right. Unfortunately, pole is gone, so that's five balls. And they're just missing that weave entry. So they have to go into the weaves with that first pole on their left shoulder. So they've just picked up five there for making a mistake in the weaves. So we're on 15. As we turn right down to that tunnel, number 14. So wing wrap on number 18. Two to go over the wall, over the kennel club jump, 16. Point six nine. So I believe there's probably time faults on that with uh, 15 faults. Okay, so next on the line, Neil Coombs with Rufus. This is a Nova Scotia duck tolling retriever. Decoy man's Piper John of Gold. Oh, unfortunately that's the wrong course, so that does mean an elimination. So in order to qualify for this event, all our dogs and handlers have gone through a, a process. Um, first of all, obviously, they have to have no collie in them. And then they uh, compete at heats throughout the year at various different agility shows. And uh, 
through that process, uh, whittled down to a few that actually can uh, come and run in the final here at Crufts. So because this is a novice competition, that means that all the dogs um, have qualified whilst they were between grades three and five. So that's sort of in the middle of the road. So if you like, for agility, grades go one to seven. So we're ready with the next dog. This is Selena Bray with Blind. This is another Australian Kelpie. So up over the Yugi Noob jump into the tunnel. Managed to stay in there, well done. So down into the tunnel. It's calling right there. Oh, the pole has gone unfortunately as we do that wing wrap there. So we're on uh, 547826. So next to go, this is Tracy Hunt with Loki, Hungarian Vizsla, Rusted Valley Rakoff. See if he gets very excited about his agility, he won't stop barking. So he's going to do that all the way around, I think. So down over the Kennel Club jump, over the Yuki Luba jump. There are principal sponsors of Crufts, and we're very grateful for their sponsorship. Over number 10 from Toe Rides. So Tracy often to go through the middle of those two jumps there. Gives us straight a line into the tunnel. Turn right. Two to go, come on. Come on, Tracy. One more, well done. Clear round. 34, 5, 8, 3. Well done. That goes into second place. So next to go, Joanne Sampson with Kira. This is another Hungarian Vissa. She's 12 years old. Wait. Wait. And uh, in fact, this is her second time at Crufts. Well, look at that, she doesn't look 12 years old, does she at all? So, just miss the jump there though, five faults. refusal. Australian Kelpie this time. So this is Layla Stretch with Sniper. Bat 
Fink bat out of hell? So he's five years old. I think he's quite excited about uh, what's about to happen. Absolutely loves his agility. So here we go, through the tyre. Turning right. Well done. Down through the Eucalypt jump into the tunnel. So, next to go. So, next to go on the line, this is Sarah Graham with Geordie. Crossbreed. Wheat. Wheat. The rescue. down to medium. Uh, all the dogs get measured in agility to make sure that they are in uh, the correct height for their own size. So we're just making sure that everything is as it should be. The weaves obviously stay the same. The course stays the same. And uh, we are awarding heights for, sorry, trophies for each height. So this is in effect a separate competition for the medium dogs. So just making sure that the tyre and the timing is at the right height. I think we're ready to go. Yeah. Okay, so our judge is ready. So, first to go in the mediums, this is Sam Lane, Woodhouse Quartz of Diamonding. Down through the YouTube jump into those wheels. Got a lot to say to herself. Give yourself a safe to dime. And uh, Sam says he barks when he's happy, so I guess he's pretty happy at the moment. So wing wrap on number 18. Two to go, go on Sam. It's a cracking one. Well done. 30.058. Well done, Sam. Goes into the lead on the mediums. So, this is Pickles, crossbreed. 
I'm going to hazard a guess at a terrier cross. Julie Saunders is running him today, and uh, he's 10 years old. Into the sun. Savannah. This is a Sheltie, four years old. Like a Satira, my son Seeker. Oh, didn't want to do that. Wasn't in the plan, but unfortunately, taking the wrong course does mean an elimination. Okay, so next on the line, it's Nicola Wildman. This is Zoom. Oh, 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 Ten years old, a rescue dog. later on.
Okay, so now on the line we have Angie Edwards. This is Flossie, miniature Australian shepherd dog. Eight years old. In the top. Fourth time at the Crofts. So we've got two to go. Sorry, three dogs to go, I should say. And uh, following this, we've got the Cruft Singles Heats, which always is very exciting. So Karen Gibbons is on the line. This is Riverbend Mitzi, Agility Warrant Gold. Willow is her pet name. Lovely little Sheltie. Down over the Ukulele Jump into the tunnel. Nicely through the weave pass there. Oh, some good turns from this little dog. These handlers will be trying to cut the time down by getting tight turns. We're all just going to go a different way using the dog's natural line. Over the last jump. Oh, that's a great time. 29.584 goes into second place. Well done, Karen. So, Lara Staplehurst is next. With Alfie, the English Springer Spaniel. Five years old. He's another rescue dog from many tears. So, if any of you have rescue dogs out there and you fancy doing some agility, you can find out about the different uh, training clubs in your area from the Kennel Club stand. We're going online. Turning right. It's a good turn as we go down to the tunnel. Come on, Alfie. Right turn. You want another good turn there? That's a good one. Here we go. Two to go. Go on. One more. Oh, well done. 29.525 goes into second place. Well done. Great round. Okay, so the last dog to go in the novice and medium ABC. This is Des Coughlin. This is Dino the Patterdale. Kennel name, what do you got, Dino? So this is quite a young dog, he's two years old. His first cross final. Okay. So down that line, through the new jump into the top. and then on to the cross singles.
Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, it's presentation of awards time. So we're going to start with the mediums. In first place was Tash Podubecki with Lady of Croftmoor. In second place was Lara Staplehurst with Alfie Surprise. And moving on to the large, in first place was Alan Dorman with Harset Flax. And in second place, Sarah Graham with Rivers Jumping Geordie. So, ladies and gentlemen, it's lap of honour time. <laughs> 